How can you train your body against diseases like the flu? Think of your body like a soccer club. The viruses and bacteria out there are your opponents, rival soccer clubs. Some are easy to beat, like the common cold. You play them almost every season, you know their weaknesses, and you can beat them handily. Other teams are very dangerous, like tetanus. Team tetanus plays dirty and can seriously injure opposing players. Fortunately, they play in other leagues, so you rarely play them, though it's always possible to get matched up with them in a large tournament. In between is influenza, known as the flu. Team flu can also be dangerous. They are a team that constantly evolves. Every off-season, they sign some new players and coaches and change strategies to stay one step ahead of their rivals. You may not play them every year, but they've been in your league forever. And every year could be on your schedule again. A smart soccer team knows how to win. It stays healthy, even in the off-season, and prepares for all its matches. How does it prepare? First, smart soccer teams study their opponents. They watch film of their opponents' recent matches. From what they learn, they create a game plan to attack opponents' weaknesses and then practice that game plan before the match. In the same way, vaccines give your immune system the film it needs to create and practice a game plan for your upcoming opponents. Let's take the flu as an example. Each year, the new flu vaccine can show your team, your body's immune system, Team Flu's new weaknesses. Your body then trains hard to be able to take on that season's flu. You may even feel sore or tired after vaccine training. But training makes your team better prepared. Some of your opponents don't change much over time, like Team Measles. So your game plans created years ago still work fine. But for a team like the flu that changes every off-season, it's best to base your game plan on the most recent film available and practice it. Of course, even if you do, Team Flu may still score a goal or two. No game plan is perfect, just like no vaccine is perfect. You may still get infected, especially if you're exposed to a lot of virus at once. But at the end of stoppage time, you will most likely be the winner.